first serve coming from Donny Sujo. This is the start of semifinal number two. Here we go. Nice pass by Cepeda. In the middle. That's the first kill of the match. That is David Fiel. Leon, great pass from Anderson. Back row, Anderson, oh my goodness. Out to the back row player, Lankfeld, blocked another cover. Joust at the net, won by Brinkman, but covered. That tip won't work. Winters, great transition play by Fred Winters. Kept his eye on the ball the whole time, got far enough outside. Howitson recognized that his outside hitter wasn't going to be as far out as normal. Kept the set a bit inside. Great play by Canada. Email me at usavlive at gmail.com. That's usavlive at gmail.com. Or you can tweet me at usavlive. Shane, and I'll actually I'll hide the name for a second. I'll hide the last name. You'll know who it is in a second. Shane asks, who do you think is the best player on the U.S.? Uh, give me a second to think about that, Shane. Thanks for the email. Leon to serve. Lamborn, great pass. Landerson! You know what? The crowd was cheering all around me before Anderson even hit that ball. The crowd recognized that he did not have much of a block to face as the Cuban block was stuck with the middle, David Lee. The set went to Anderson. The crowd already started cheering. He pounded it down. It's 3-2. to two. Served by Lee goes long. Two straight serve errors for the U.S. It's 3-all. Shane, your question, who do you think is the best player on the U.S. team? I think it's time to reveal it. Shane's last name is Sujo, the son of Donald Sujo, the USA setter. Shane, best player is terms as, in terms of the best future. Got to be Matt Anderson, youngest player, phenomenal player. Russ Holmes puts it away. Russ Holmes also a future with the USA team, just 29, which is young according to Team USA standards. Best player. Ah. The guy serving right now is pretty solid. I love how Reed Pretty plays. If I'm going to give an overall best player, just because I think he's going to be on the team for a while, it's got to be Matt Anderson. Meanwhile, Clayne Stanley serves up an ace. It's 5-3. Thanks for the question, Shane. Your dad's doing great. Darnell Duff sent us an email, says... If Canada doesn't win, is it correct they wouldn't be invited to one of the qualification tournaments in June because they didn't place top three in last year's Pan American Cup? It's actually not based on the Pan American Cup, Darnell. It's based on their world rankings as of January. Cuba, five. USA, six. Puerto Rico, 17. Canada, 18. Thanks for the question. Outside to Cruz off the block and out of bounds, and it's 10 all. Lee probably will go at Wilfredo Leon. He does. Good pass again. Cepeda blocked, covered by Gutierrez. Diaz, back row, Hernandez stuffed. Four blocks in a row. Pretty and Holmes get another one. Serve coming from Fiel. Good pass from Pretty. He gets the set. He puts that one away in the angle. Sujo going right back to his veteran outside hitter right after he committed an error. That is trust in your hitters. And as a hitter, you want that ball after you hit it out. If you get blocked or you hit it out, you want the ball right away to put it away. Nice job by Pretty. It's 11-6. Clay Stanley back to serve. Nice pass from Leon. They're really going after Leon. Stuff block again for Holmes and Pretty. Again on Fernando Hernandez. They're up 14-11 right now. They've got three match points. Winters will serve for the first one. Nice pass by Berrios. Stuff, it's covered. Another chance for Rivera. Stuffed again, that's in. Roof for Sudius and Brinkman. And Team Canada is going to the championship game tomorrow night for a chance to play in the 2012 London Olympic Games. What a match. The whole crowd is standing. I'll pick up the mic, I'll stand up. Here we go, it's match point for the USA at 24-13. This is to make it to the championship against Canada tomorrow. The winner of that match will make it to the Olympics. Anderson, the toss, the serve. Good pass from Gutierrez, Estrada. 
outside. Cepeda too tight, past the block, out of bounds, but not before Clay Stanley touched it. USA again just needs a side out for the match. Good pass by Lamborn, or yeah, good pass by Lamborn. Stanley blocked again, covers himself. Over the net, oh my goodness, what a way to end it. Clay Stanley covers himself. It goes about 18 feet in the air and lands just over the net on the Cuban side. They didn't recognize it. 25 to 16, USA closes out Cuba here in set four. The USA will play Team Canada tomorrow at 8 p.m. Pacific Standard Time right here at the Wallsford Pyramid on the campus of Long Beach State University for a spot in the Olympics.